tactics and strategy in Shinkago Shinru, which is my art, which is fire, earth, water, wind. All right, so if everybody stands up. Jack, I know you were excited to work on yourself. So we'll start with that. So the first one we're going to do is we're going to work on a water technique. All right. And again, it's not limited. The idea is just thinking of the strategy of what goes on. Just like how a wave comes back and then crash. I come in and destroy. Water technique. By the numbers, defensive stance, coming back, away from the harm, shattering as I come back in. Through the face, stepping all the way through. The movement is a twist of the wrist, a twist of the arm. That's kicking down, bring them down to the ground. And there's the lock. Watch again. Water techniques. Back, come in, full close. Does anybody need to see it again? Alright, that's already destroyed. Come through, step all the way through. Bam. It's not just a sweep. This is bring it in, rotate. Rotate. He's already going down. I don't even need the sweep. He's going down. But make sure you're utilizing that rotation. Utilize your body against his. Use his body for the technique. And there's a lot. All right, again, go. Thank you, sir. My first technique is to flow away from the energy. He's coming towards me. I destroy. This time, I'm going to come in, lock, bring down. All right? <laughs> you okay? <laughs> Heard his arm make a weird noise. We don't like that. Show me. We're good. Do it slowly. What if his arm is yellow? Let's do it slower. <laughs> Wave destroys. <laughs> it's working. And it will heal. You have another one. This isn't just a simple slap. All right? This is a destroy, probably more effective than a fist. I love this technique. As we come in, the wave's going to grab as we bring down, ever so gently. Boom. Okay? All right, let me need to see it again. Fire concept. Uh, Jack, I'll borrow you. Fire concept is a consuming overall pull through uh, type of techniques. These, these the strategies to overwhelm the opponent before he has a chance. All right, so instead of drawing away, we're going to come in. So as he's punching in, right in. Totally different direction. Totally different types of off. I'm just consuming before he has a chance to think. So again, as he's punching, fire technique. All right, now we're going to do a slower. Using a palm heel. Also known as Oshu Ken, funny enough, wave hand. I'm going to use a fire technique. All right? As the punch comes, it's the same type of block. All right? I'm destroying the arm, but I'm coming to the face, into the eyes, grabbing. All right? If I stop here, I rip his face off. There's no mercy in this strike. It's not a just pop, get off of me. I don't want to touch me. We're going through his face and jamming it to the floor, consuming bring him down. One more time and then you go. Ready? <laughs> Fire technique, all consuming. Hachime, what's the version of this choke? First one's going to come uh, down, not so yeah. much for that clear, okay, okay, but so okay, I can okay. place my hands okay. in his eye sock. Curl. Twist. Press, Press down. And bring him down. Great. Yeah, Notice he stay. goes right into the break you'll, you'll live. Right? All right, one of the concepts in the Shikin Go Shinru, my art, is that you never let, let go of control. The whole idea is control at all times. Control yourself, control your opponent, even beyond doing that. I try to have my students not fight first. But when it fails, we'll find the right strategy and pick the right technique for the right time. Again, as he's choking, I decide fire is the best technique. Into the eyes. Twist. We'll break. Take a passive stance. As he's coming towards me, with a straight punch, you start. Give us a flow. That's all right. It's not damaging. It's not destroying, consuming like fire. But maybe this is crazy Uncle Frank that has a habit of getting stinking drunk every Fourth of July. We all have him. All right. I don't want to necessarily put him in a hospital. Just want to make sure he's not hurting me. All right. Again, he's coming in. All right. Earning.
technique, slowly now. <coughs> like a whirlwind, you're thinking tornado with an air technique. As he's coming in, all right, we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning. Really release. One more time. Air technique comes in. Okay. Mm -hmm. The first thing we're going to do with our with our earth technique is we're going to ground ourselves. So I step out as I missile into the hand, releasing the hand. Bam! There's the first brace. So come around here. All right. Step around. Yeah. Anybody behind wants to move? Keep this hand. That's going to be hard today. We're all slipping. <laughs> all right? But as I bring him around, I rotate. Okay? Here's the other break. But I keep my grounding. My earth technique. So again, he's grabbing me through. <clears throat> Boom. Coming over. And whatever numerous breaks you want to add to the board at that point. That's the first technique. One more time. Comes around. Okay. Step into a wide grounding stance. You see how he's already moving? Missile. Bam! Now look, unlock it. Come around. Turn with it. A lot of places do a very similar technique, but they just let him fly. Control at all times. I don't lose control of my opponent until I choose to lose. He's broken here. Uh, broke the wrist, broke the arm, broke the face. But you made it. Why I decided to form Shikago Shinru. It's evolution, self defense style. So you evolve to whatever meets you. The last thing I'm going to do is my favorite weapon. All right, the Minriki Gasari. Traditionally, it's a chain with weights. We're going to practice utilizing our belts. So as I talk, go ahead and take. Each one of your partners have, we only need one belt. Take a belt off. All right. Uh, Ryan, I'll borrow you. This is my favorite weapon for one reason only. As you can see, I have a rope version. It's just as effective as the chain one. And I bring it to the airports all the time. Okay? Totally legal. But everybody wears one of these anyway. Your belt, your leather belt. All right? So these techniques will work. So what we want to do, this is what I call an equalizer. I'm now surrounded, or I know this guy is either trained or 400 pounds bigger than me. I'm going to use an equal so this best is to All right. As he's coming, wrap. Okay, watch that yeah. in slow motion. I come off that line of attack as I wrap. All right, bring it through to the face. Nice. Choking him out. All right. Watch it again, and I'll demonstrate with my belt so you can see how you're going to be utilizing it yourself. As he's coming with a punch, wrap to the face, around. All right? Bring him down. Brian, do you want to try any techniques on me right now? <laughs> okay? There's so many a uh, aspects of the Manriki. We do not have time to just to actually show it now. So we're just going to try this one technique to give you a taste. With your belts, pull them in half. If you're on the street, same thing. All right? If he's throwing a punch, it could be as simple as this. This could be a belt or a scarf, anything like this. He's throwing a punch. Come on. Okay, equalizer. But let's try the one technique. <laughs> Punches, wrap. Round. He doesn't want to fight. Anybody need to see it again? <laughs> Slowly, one more time. Last time, pay attention. Last time. What's that? Yes. Uh, I need one more volunteer. Quick, quick, quick. You just volunteer. Come in. You need to see it there. As he's punching, he's in. There's the wrap. There's the catch. On him, I got underneath, but it's okay. Just go bring him down. He's still tied up. That's all right. Hachimei!